All right, so um, uh, Mr. Sisman was uh, also on the program and he said uh, that when you were sworn in as sheriff in 2005, you demoted the LGBT staff from senior leadership positions at the sheriff's office. How do you respond to that charge? Well, I didn't look at uh, staff of uh, LGBT, say it again? LGBT. LGBT uh, staff. What I did was, I uh, normally what, what a sheriff does uh, when, when, when they take office is that they will uh, keep a couple of individuals off of the staff and then have them vet the individuals that apply. And uh, normally those individuals that could apply for that position are normally either lieutenants and above to apply for those uh, positions. And all of the individuals would have to reapply for that position. Well, I did it differently. I came in and I knew that uh, my success or failure was going to depend on the people that I surrounded myself with. So instead of having somebody to come in and vet those employees, I mean those uh, applicants, I uh, told uh, the, the staff that anybody that has been here, that works here, can apply for that position. I had 132 people apply for the position. I interviewed all 132 of those individuals. After that, I uh, broke it down to uh, 40 out of those 132. I took 40 and um, uh, uh, interviewed them again. And then uh, after that, I selected the individuals to be on, on my staff. And I did not look at whether they were LGBT. Uh, I see. Uh, does the Travis County Sheriff's Department have a, 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 a sexual orientation non-discrimination policy in place? Yes, we do. Okay. Uh, so, um, you know, as, as you're aware, this is...